good afternoon from the Socrates Center. So this is absolutely incredible. This morning the guys came and finished up the work on the temple instructor for the horses. I'm blown away. I mean, they left probably two hours ago, but I've been teaching and I've been online. And they gifted me with bananas from my own property because I can't get at them because they're quite high in the trees and I don't have the tools yet, but I'm going to switch the view here from well, part of the ponds. The ponds are across here. Here's the road. House is right up ahead of me here. And then we have our two horses here who are so spoiled. And they're actually quite good because they were they stood right here while the guys were working. Oh, look at her. She's like, give me the bucket. Give me the bucket. They know their food is sitting right there in the two buckets. But look at this. Look at this ginormous shelter that they have. It's all wide open, which is great because they don't need to be, you know, they don't need to be enclosed. And as I, I came close, I was like, wow, look at, they've got barucha, which is wood chips. They've even embedded some wood chips down here for them, which is just amazing. This butterfly bush, hopefully it'll come back. The horses have kind of destroyed it. And they, they have even taken the salt bucket, which is this guy here, and engineered a way to prop it up so that the horses can lick their little salt lick there on a tree stump. They've secured it to this tree stump. <laughs> Amazing. And I was just coming down to do this. I've got my mud boots on and I'm still sweaty from my class. So I was going to move my the water trough, which was way down by the, you can kind of see the, the former, the other, sadly, the other stable that they put together, the shelter for me, which was a lot more work because it has sort of walls and separation. It's got gates. But it'll be usable in the future when it's not, you know, when it's not torrentially, we're not in the torrential rainy season, I should say. And so they have the water trough moved, they filled it for me. Oh my god, they even have the hay bags, I just noticed this. They've placed the hay bags here for me to hang them. I'm sure they don't, you know, they're not sure where I want them. They've got a little hook for my brush, <laughs> for my brush and for the water. Um, you know, the net for the cleaning the water. I'm just recognizing that now. They have all my tools brought up from the, the swamp. I call it the swamp down there now. Amazing. These guys are absolutely amazing. I've never seen anything like it. Look at that. Look at that beautiful structure. We could have a party here. 